now decided to do a water fast. So yeah, we decided to do a water fast and we're starting on, oh, we started today, but it's basically just water. So we're just gonna be drinking strictly water. And we started today. Um, yesterday I was like, I could do it, but today I'm just like, I don't know, like it's fine. <laughs> I literally walked in the kitchen and can smell food. And I was just like, oh my days, how am I gonna survive this? What a fast. I've done it before. I only did two days. <coughs> uh, I did two days and that's like the longest I've ever done a water fast. So it's been, um, I, fa I did my water fast since Monday. So it's literally been 72 hours since I last ate. Like, what? Anyways, I decided to, my sister was going to be the fast but she ended up not doing it. And I decided just to go ahead with it. There's a lot of benefits with water fasting and I'll probably <coughs> write some notes down so I can explain what but, uh, the benefits of it. So I decided to just do a three day water fast. I've done a water fast in the past back when I was like 19 or 20 with my mom. And we did it, I did two days. I think we both did two days. I don't really remember, but I've done a water fasting before. I did two days. Um, Today I bit my record and I did three days. So, um, this is doctor that I highly recommend to watch her video. Her name is Dr. Minzy Powell. That's her. Like she has some good, like she has good knowledge about fasting, intimate fasting, um, uh, how women should be intimate fasting. Like she's really, really good. And one of her videos I watched on how to break a free day fasting. Um, I watched it yesterday and then after work I went to go buy the stuff. I forgot to record it. But anyways, I brought bone, bone broth, I brought kimchi, I brought bananas and I brought some meat. So with the four step process and I will probably explain it later on. So first, you have to, when you break your fast, you have to have bone broth. There's other things you can have, but I decided to just choose bone broth. And then you have to wait like 30 minutes to one hour to um, go to the next step. So I had bone broth, and then now I'm eating kimchi. Yeah. A few moments later. I wanna be eating this banana. <laughs> it's a prebiotic. So the kimchi is it's a probiotic and the banana is prebiotic. You can also get apples, asparagus, garlic, onions. But bananas are easy to go after banana, after the prebiotic, another 30 minutes, one hour, then you can eat clean protein. So you can eat straight chicken, beef, recommend it all. I don't know if you're vegan, but we love meat in here, so Bruh. I'm gonna be having chicken, maybe like 150 grams chicken on its own. And then after that, <clears throat> I'm gonna finally have a proper meal but that's that was the way that she recommended to break a fast just so that it doesn't do any harm to the gut and then look, I actually ate all I'm excited because I can eat the banana now oh yeah Yeah, no idea. 
how will this banana taste? After three days, I'm not eating. <laughs> Best <laughs> Finally breaking my fast. So this is the clean protein. Look, it's a chicken breast, no seasoning, and then this one has seasoning. And yeah. After I eat my clean protein, I have a Caesar salad. Yum. And I also have fruit. So I cut some more melon. A few moments later. Let's go. 173.1 kg. Ellos no quieren que yo gane, pero ya gané. En la casa por la playa ya la cotice. El precio de ayer no es el de hoy. No necesita GPS pasado el pa' donde voy. Yeah, I don't think she does though. Yeah. That was not that. 